Hello, this is Onyx Carol, and today I'm going to be doing a message for Scorpio. Let's go ahead and do a message for Scorpio. What does Scorpio need to know? All right. All right, so you have incoming communication. Vindicated. 222. Two, two. And bottom of the deck is December. All right. So let's see what we have here. For Scorpio, thank you guys for hitting the like button. I really do appreciate it. All right. All right. So you guys have incoming communication here. Um, this could be via text message. This could be via phone call, via email. Um, let's look into whatever this is. Whatever it is, you're going to be vindicated. Like some, You're going to be really happy that either someone sees something that's been going on. And you could also be seeing 222, that angel number here, um, which really just means, I mean, there's a lot of meanings to it, but it could mean that you have a lot of like spiritual guidance around you. Um, and also bottom of the deck, the month of December could be really important tied to this message as well. Okay. Um, so let's clarify incoming communication. Incoming communication. All right, so we have the sun reverse and the nine of wands. So I feel like there's something that has been very unhappy or something that's been hidden tied to a situation where you've had to fight, okay, and stand your ground, uh, defend yourself. And um, I feel like throughout this process, you may have felt very beat down, wore down mentally, emotionally, physically, kind of um, energetically. Um, but some type of communication is coming in about something that, um, see, hasn't been seen. Let's see. Yeah, four of swords reversed. So there's some type of information um, that you're about to be taking action on. Some type of information that somebody's been looking at, processing. Um, I'm hearing unbeknownst to you, okay, about this person. Let's see. You also have the Queen of Wands. So let's see. Hmm. So whoever's coming in, um, they're showing up here as a queen or king of wands here. It could be a feminine energy. There's some type of communication that's coming in, again, that you've had to defend yourself against this person. This could be a third party person. Um, what are they going to be saying? Death reverse. They're going to be talking about some type of issue that has been lingering on and hasn't had some type of ending to it. Okay, uh, we have the Three of Pentacles reverse and the Knight of Swords reverse. I feel like this person is very aggressive. They make it hard to work with them. They try to bully people. Um, this is somebody who's very confident when they do it as well, though. Um, but the Queen of Swords, I feel like you have the truth of some type of situation. Um, you're able to advocate for yourself against this person. You may be like less experienced. You may be younger. You may something tied to like you compared to this person, um, works in your favor completely. Nine of Pentacles and you're a self-starter. Like you're very independent. You can take care of yourself and take care of situations you don't need but a buddy system okay so this person could be tied to someone who or a group of people co-workers whatever third parties where they need a group of people to to bother you to harass to whatever the case is so you're going to be getting some type of incoming communication from this person um they have been delayed or something that they were expecting to be fast and quick um is not happening this could be tied to the ten of pentacles your contract with this person a marriage a work environment um your money a family matter family money okay um, something's going to go in your favor tied to your money, tied to a family situation because the Six of Pentacles is clarifying the Ten of Pentacles. So for you, this is fine. This is completely fine here. You're showing up here as the Queen or King of Pentacles. But for this person, again, they're getting, they're, they get delayed. And also I'm hearing like a pay cut. This person could basically get less money than they expected in some type of situation 
for your sorrows. The Empress or the Emperor and the Ace of Cups reverse. So I feel like the universe is balancing something out where this person's like, okay, either they take a pay cut or they end up just getting less payment or less money or less of something going in their favor tied to whatever they've done to you. Okay. Um, so it looks like this communication that is coming in is going to, hmm, I feel like this person wants to kind of incite. They want to kind of incite some type of fear. They want to basically, okay, three of pentacles reverse, knight of swords reverse. This person's plot and ploy is to try to intimidate. They're trying to not cooperate. They're trying to say, you know what? This is what we're going to agree to. These are your options. This is what we're going to do, A or B. And really, for you, there's C, there's D, there's E, there's F. Like the universe has, or whatever you believe in your higher power, has made this go in your favor. Like your family situation, your contract, your whatever this Ten of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles is for you, goes in your favor regardless. It's protected here, okay? Um, but they're going to make it seem like, like you need to work with them. But again, you have the truth. You can advocate for yourself. Um, you have a great track record, especially tied to um, being honest, okay, um, and straightforward and reliable. So continue to trust your intuition. These people, the way that they communicate with you um, is going to seem like you like, uh, basically their goal is to make you not trust your intuition. But again, I feel like the way you respond shifts this energy because Ada wants reverse. They realize like, oh, okay, we can't mess with Scorpio. We can't manipulate the situation it's just not going to work the way that we expected it to so then they end up in the five of pentacles and again this is like you know that your higher powers energy whatever you believe in or the universe's way of like giving you what you're owed if that makes sense okay so let's see i want to clarify the five of pentacles So there's a masculine energy here showing up as a king or queen of cups in reverse, any gender here. Um, but whoever this person is, they are very manipulative, especially when it comes to a winning or feeling like they come out on top of a situation with you. The five of pentacles is clarified by this person. So yeah, they're going to be left out in the cold. Um, I feel like this person is like hoping, you know, I'm hearing living on a prayer. They're hoping for... Um, whoever they work with, whoever they hired, whoever they're with, whoever this Queen of Wands energy is um, in this reading, um, they're hoping that they're going to be able to talk to you, get you to agree to something, intimidate you, make you seem like, make you feel like your options are limited or your options are like little, little, little. It's very small, but that's just not the case. Six of Swords, I feel like when they realize that uh, this isn't happening, that they can't sit and manipulate you or some type of situation here um they can't fight with you they can't do anything they can't i mean it's not working the harassment the uh, you have choices whatever they're trying to plot and plan doesn't end up working um then they're gonna six of swords just be like you know what let's wrap it up like i can't can't do it anymore okay yeah, Ten of Swords is going to be over. So again, um, that's what I'm getting here for what you need to know. Some type of incoming communication is coming to basically see if they can like weasel their way in to manipulate you to feel like you only have two choices. Agree with? And both of the choices work out in their favor, if that makes sense, okay? Next, we have Vindicated. So the Ace of Pentacles reverse. I feel like you're going to be vindicated in the form of tangible items, in the form, in the hmm, in the form of opportunities as well. So whatever these people have been trying to do, whether it's to take money from you, you're gonna see them embarrassed. Six of Wands reverse. You're gonna see them upset. You're gonna see them visibly disappointed that you are vindicated because you have the truth. Three of Wands reverse. You have basically these people are gonna be blocked. And they have been blocked from whatever they've been trying to do. 
Um, these people have been continuing to push and continuing to push and let's try this strategy. Let's try that strategy. Yada, yada, yada. Whatever they're doing, yada, yada, yada. And then what? The Wheel of Fortune reverse. It, nothing has worked, okay? Um, I feel like you were very intuitive. These people may have felt like they were winning if in the past, if in the past, um, you didn't know, like, okay, these people's true character or this person that you used to work with or used to be with, you didn't know their true character, how far they were willing to go. But I feel like now, I mean, high priestess, queen or king of swords, knight of wands and the nine of pentacles, you, you know how to handle a situation now. So uh, you will be vindicated in some type of situation, especially financially by, by having, again, numerous choices you have the seven of cups you have the world and you also have the magician so this is what you've manifested you're going to have a lot of different choices on how to close out this cycle um and to move forward so let's see how you're going to be vindicated eight of swords reverse so i feel like you're going to be vindicated in the form of peace and peace of mind the eight of swords is a card of feeling mentally entrapped feeling like you don't really have much of any options um and that's exactly what these people are trying to make you do with some type of incoming communication and but this is in the reverse so you're going to be coming out of overthinking about a situation and i feel like you'll be more at peace okay as something moves forward for you so let's go ahead and clarify 222 thank you guys for hitting the like button i really do appreciate it um, let's clarify 222 two, two for Scorpio. All right, so we have the King of Wands energy here and the Two of Swords. So I feel like, okay, let's, okay. You are protected against this masculine energy here showing up as a King of Wands. Um, king of cups reverse any gender here okay um there's some type of decision that is going to be made or needs to be made by this person and i feel like they're going to be playing themselves okay with the five of swords five of swords is a card of somebody who thinks about themselves they're backstabber they only think about what they can gain from a situation like li literally look at that card it's so dark and dreary and like he's like taking things from people he he doesn't he has more swords in his hand than he has hands okay so um this is somebody who basically this uh, masculine energy any gender um they're gonna have to sit and think about what do i want to do do i want to be an adult do i want to handle the situation the proper way do i want to be brave and courageous or do i want to backstab do i want to harm do i want to manipulate right um and clarifying this you have justice and the fool okay so it ends up being that you know your justice is freedom from this situation um i also feel like your justice is getting out of the situation and not dealing with this person um in the future and i also feel like you're going to realize how protected you have been um tied to this situation as something comes in for you um long term you're also going to be able to heal the stars clarifying the knight of pentacles um and any type of corruption any type of delays um again i feel like whatever you've been waiting for um as far as your justice is coming okay and again it's going to come in the form of having different options now these people have one of two options they can work with you or they can bully you or manipulate you to make you feel like you have to work with them and you're going to realize you have this option, you have that option, you could do this, you could do that, you could, you know, you're going to have the ball in your court tied to uh, how you want to handle the situation. Bottom of the deck is December. So the month of December could be really important here. Uh, we have the seven of wands reverse and the page of pentacles. So something could have been um, offered to you in the month of December or Something could have happened in the month of December or somebody could, um, this could be representing a person. Um, this is a general reading. It'll be different for everybody. But whatever it is, some type of offer is going to be given to you 
for the month of December or something that happened in the past December or any Decembers here. Um, I feel like somebody, what whatever offer this is, it's going to be a small olive branch, but it is going to progressively move you forward. Um, and also it could come from this, um, this person, this Queen of Wands, and also this King of Cups as well, okay? Um, but whatever it is, I feel like it's going to not make up for what happened in the month of December of any year, but it's going to balance it out. So I feel like that's what you don't see, that there's going to be some type of offer that basically is going to help you heal from um, and push forward from some type of situation where somebody messed up on something or did something incorrectly um, in the month of December. They want to positively, progressively move forward, okay? So let's go ahead and get some advice for Scorpio. Let's get some advice for Scorpio. All right, so you have compromise, ask for help from others, and you're ready. Okay. So um, this could be a good time as something plays out, especially if you have some type of like meeting, meeting of the mind, conversation, um, to work on what, what, what kind of things would you compromise? So I feel like as something comes forward towards you, you're going to be realizing these people's options. You're going to be realizing what they're wanting, that kind of thing. And compromising in a sense tied to um, this person could be helpful. But again, this is, I mean, everyone's situation is different. I feel like for this, this is basically saying like your finances and your stability are fine, but this King of Swords energy in reverse is looking for it's like they're when when they communicate to you, they're going to um, ask you, or they're going to say, or they're going to write. This is what we want, and I feel like if this person feels like they're going to get even a little, they, basically they aim high, so they get just a little bit. If that makes sense. So if really the you know they're wanting this, that, and that, they're going to try to say something or bully you to get this, that, and that. But really, they know that realistically, they can only get one thing. If that makes sense. So. Um, there, I feel like utilize your intuition if you resonate with this to realize what the one thing is that they want because it could help um, as you're negotiating with this person or working through some type of issue. Ask for help from others. So I feel like reaching out to your friends or somebody that you're in a partnership with or working with or, you know, whoever's helping you could be really important um, because it seems like they're going to be knowing um, okay, what's right, what's not right, that kind of thing. They're going to be able to help make sense of things that may be confusing. And also you have, you're ready. So you're ready for happiness. You're ready for your wish fulfillment. You're ready for being able to uh, move forward from the situation. But again, I feel like this conversation happens first and um, then you're going to be able to realize and understand what you're what exactly you're wanting to do tied to the situation as it closes out for you so thank you guys so much for hitting the like button subscribing i really do appreciate it if you would like to book a personal reading that is below um but otherwise thank you guys so much for watching